Today I'd like to talk about parametric cones. Parametric cones are used in kiln sitters. I have a gear kiln that has a kiln sitter and I put my cone in and as the temperature increases and matures, the cone will bend and the kiln will automatically shut off. This is a great thing to have, although I do monitor it by the time because sometimes when you have a kiln sitter, if the kiln sitter is not adjusted properly, it may not pop at the proper temperature, but most of the time I have found that it works great. Now with the kiln sitters and with cones, uh, there are different temperatures and there are different cone numbers. Some of the cones start with a zero, so it goes from zero 01 through zero 022. The way this works is this is low fire bisque, low fire glazing, uh, glass glazing, um, overglaze, china, painting. These are low fires. Now anything from 01 to 022 works this way. The higher the number, the lower the temperature, which is a little bit opposite of what we're used to. Okay, if you look if you're putting a temperature up on this on your stove, the higher the number, the higher the temperature. But it doesn't work like that with the zeros and the low fire glazing. The higher the number, the lower the temperature. So I usually will bisque at 04. Um, on, the, on the box, you will see the 04. I always write bisque on it so I don't get confused because I have all kinds of um, numbers of cones in my shed and I want to make sure that I, I, I'm remembering this properly. Cones inside look like this. You can get these at any pottery shop. They're inexpensive. They have a number on them. I put them in the cone sitter, kiln sitter, just like this. Put them right down so when I'm looking directly at my kiln sitter, I can see the number on the right hand side. And they have to be scented properly. And if they're not, then they may not shut off properly, which will give you an over firing or an under firing. When I do bisque, I usually will bisque at 04. And then I'll glaze at a 06 glaze. This is for earthenware. Uh, I'll glaze at 06. Now, so what I'm doing is I'm bisking at 04, I'm glazing at 06, so I'm actually glazing at a lower temperature than I bisked. But when you do stoneware, it's just the opposite. When you do stoneware, which is a high, mid to high fire, the higher the number, the higher the temperature, just like an oven in our kitchen. So if you want to bisque, um, glaze, bisque and glaze, stoneware, you will bisque at a 04. Bisque, any kind of bisque, whether you're doing earthenware or you're doing stoneware, bisque is bisque, okay, and you don't need it any firmer than a 04. So I bisque at 04, and then I will get the glaze that I decide I want. If I want a cone 5 glaze or cone 6 glaze, then I will use the cone 5 and the cone 6. And what I do on my um, Orton cone box is I will write 6 stone or 5 stone so I know that if I'm using stone clay that I have to use these cones, these cone numbers just so I don't get confused. So basically that's very simple. That's the way it is. With the um, the bisking and the low firing you want to use 01 through 022. The higher the number, the lower the temperature. If you're bisking with the 04 and you want to use stoneware, you're going to use cone 1 through cone 10. Now normally um, a high fire is 7 to 10 and a mid range would be probably 4, 5, 6. I always do my stoneware in my electric kiln, my oxidation kiln, 5 or 6. It comes out very well. That's all for today on the Orton Cones.